to it. Tonight, Disney making it clear masks are mandatory at its theme parks and public places, even for people who have gotten that vaccine. News 6's Troy Campbell live outside Walt Disney World with details on the company's decision. Troy. Yeah, Matt, so ever since the Walt Disney World Resort opened up back in July, they've been requiring everyone over the age of two to wear a facial covering. Well, according to the CDC, science shows that these masks might still be required in order to prevent any future spread. The Walt Disney World Resort updating its COVID-19 facial covering policy on their website Thursday, saying facial coverings must be worn by everyone ages two and up, including those who have received a COVID-19 vaccine. Also in a post on the company's website, Disney Parks Chief Medical Officer, Dr. Pamela Heimel, saying the Walt Disney World Resort will continue considering the guidance of various governmental authorities and health agencies, including the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. The CDC currently recommending anyone who's been fully vaccinated to still wear a mask in public, saying there are still a lot of unknowns about transmission. The CDC advising, quote, we also don't know yet whether getting a COVID-19 vaccine will prevent you from spreading the virus that causes COVID-19 to other people, even if you don't get sick yourself. According to this data from the Florida Department of Health, compiled by New6 and ClickOrlando.com, more than 7% of people here in Florida have received at least one dose of a vaccine. And tonight, Disney tells me it will continue to evolve their COVID-19 protocols based on advice from their health advisors. They also uh, they require a certain type of facial coverings to enter the park. For example, if you wear a neck gaiter, you won't be allowed in. We posted a copy of their mask mandate up at ClickOrlando.com. Live outside Walt Disney World tonight, Troy Campbell getting results, News 6. Good to know, Troy. Thank you.